everyone, David once again. Uh, today's topic is going to be about mini disc. Now, mini disc these were very popular back in the early 90s, and um, there were some artists. There were some artists that also had, you know, their their music record. They had the music released to, to play to, to play mini disc, but you know, after after a while, the, the pre-recorded mini disc faded fade out. But the mini disc were around for about about 20, 20 over 20 years. Um, I first got my first. I first got my first mini disc, mini disc recorder back back in the um, mid nineties, and of course got you know mini disc for it. Um, what's cool about ha what was cool about the, about the mini disc, mini disc recorder it has it had like a like a stereo stereo and mono function. But either way, you, you still you still gotta get the um, get the um, getting the, the clear digital stereo 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 sound. If you had like a if I had, if I if I if you're if I got like because back back in the um, this record that I had, it had like a, like an optical button, on, an optical switch, like an optical switch on the optical um, connection, hooked, hooked, hooked from there to, to like an optical connection like, on, on your stereo stereo system or or to your to your to your CD player, you'd be able to get get like a digital record, use your other other connection, you get like like analog connection. But what was cool about these mini disc is that if you had the thing on the on mono, you can get double time recording onto a mini disc. So, for example, a mini disc that was like 74 minutes long, if you put that on mono mode, you would be able to get two and a half hours of music on one disc. And and this is one of those coolest features because I love this. And not only will you be able to get more music on a disc, and what's cool is that is that on these on, on the mini on the mini mid disc mini disc, disc records, is that once once you're done recording songs on there, you can if you want to you can change the order, you could you can Change tracks around on the mini disc if you want to. You can you know erase, re erase one track and record another track and pump it, or you can erase the whole whole entire disc and record again. It's, I mean that was one of the most coolest things on a mini disc. But as time went on, of course when we got into like the like the you know the you know the um, mid 2000s, probably by, by probably by, by 2010 or so, mini disc started you know fading out. Because of uh, how popular MP, how MP, how popular MP3 was getting, you know, music music downloads, you know, iPods and and you know, and and all that. By that time, the mini disc recorders and players were like faded out. But although you can still find some of these like online, you know, like if you go go like get like like certain web websites, some of them they still they still sell some of the mini disc recorders, recorders and discs online, although they're not as popular as they were 20 years ago. So, if like one of those vintage, vintage you know, collectors and want you know if you want to find find like blank blank mini disc or blank if you want to find blank mini disc or recorders, you could always look online. With that being said, this is David. Thank you for watching, and we'll talk soon.